Hey everyone, it's Wednesday the 10th of May and it's almost 1.45 in the afternoon and in today's video we're going to be unboxing another Amazon mystery box that I got on eBay. Before that though I've got a couple of parcels on the floor that I want to open up so let me just get into position and just rotate the camera screen around so I can see what I'm doing. Yeah, so I've got another one. Now I already know what this one is, as it's from um, laptop, advanced laptop solutions on eBay. Yesterday, and I can't believe it's arrived that quick. As per previous video, I bought a new keyboard for this one, or a replacement keyboard, I should say. For that Dallas a Latu D410. Now I found a replacement keyboard, there's the old one, I'll just show you this because it has got what looked like water damage which might explain why it's completely dead. Yeah I ordered this late yesterday afternoon and it's the only computer component I have actually ordered and um, I'm pretty certain that's what that is so if that's arrived that quick that is impressive. Oh. So we'll have a quick look at this one. DPD local. Oh, is that what the blue colour is for? Wonder why DPD had um, different colours. Right. This box is ridiculously light, so I am pretty certain it is a keyboard. Yep, there it is. Replacement keyboard. And that is squeaky clean on the back here. Same connector, same everything. So I can fit that later and hopefully have a working um, keyboard. Not that the uh, laptop is, you know, it's not any use or anything. Stupid thing is, I cannot find one for that HP, which is a lot newer than this. You know, this is an old Windows XP. With a gigabyte of RAM on it, by the way, I did look and a 2 GHz processor, so it wouldn't have been a bad machine back in the day, considering its size. Um, I found it way easier to get this keyboard for that old laptop. I can't find one for the HP. In fact, when I looked on eBay, there's very few listings, at least in the UK, um, regarding that HP G60. Which I thought was quite odd. Oh, and I've been through the other, the other Dell, the uh, Inspir Inspiron, Inspiron, however you pronounce it. Um, and I did find personal data on there from the previous owner, so it's all been deleted now. At least what I can find. Normally I would have just wiped the whole hard drive, but as that is working great as it is. Touch wood, touch my forehead. <laughs> I uh, thought I'd leave it as is. Let me just slide that this way for a minute. Now this is actually quite heavy and I've got a feeling, again if this is what I think it is, this arrived pretty bloody quick as well. I can't believe, seriously guys, I bought that on the 9th, which was yesterday. Sort of late afternoon, so I'm really surprised if that arrived that quick. That is impressive. Anyway, I think this one should be two barricade lights. I'm pretty certain I've not ordered anything else. Let's have a little look. Oh no, I know what it is. <laughs> it's not the barricade lights. I completely forgot I bought this. <laughs> I didn't think they were this bloody heavy either. Right. <laughs> One of those um, weight buttons, pedestrian crossings. Where does that? Do I have to lift it? It's only folding down that far. It should fold down all the way. There we go. That's a bit further. Ah, yeah, it's got to wiggle it. 
Well, it's still got all the connections and everything in here. I mean, it, it would be really easy just to rewire this and use it as a lamp, which is what I was going to do. But this is still exactly wired as it would have been out on the street. In fact, there's, there's the incoming wires. Yes, sir. I, I don't know if I could get it to work off that button, you know, so it comes on and then goes off after a while. I think I would need it rigged up to the rest of the system. Which, of course, isn't existent. <laughs> but like I said, I just... So Peter couldn't change the button on the front to a um, actual on-off switch, not a momentary switch. Maybe I could find something to put in there. And then just wire it to the lamp holder, because the lamp holder is literally there. Is that an Edison screw? Yep. So I guarantee you he's just using ordinary, probably something like a 40 watt light bulb or something in there. Does that actually say? Oh! Well, I didn't know that. There are 50 volt lamps. That's all it's got written on there, 50 volt lamp. Hmm. Will I have to change that lamp holder then? That, that is a good question. Anyway. You find a bolt to put in there as well, that's missing. I wonder why that was so heavy. Yeah, I've got two more barricade lamps. They're uh, on their way to me as well. Some more dinkies. I bought the dinkies before everything, they still haven't arrived. Is that the old keyboard? That is the old keyboard. Oh, hit the tripod leg. Right, this is what we came here to see, isn't it? Let's get it open, see what goodies we've got this time. So, again, 50 items, 50 quid. Amazon returns box. I already see something interesting right here. We have a Sipon PS3 controller. What I might do, I might actually just move this box beside me and I'll sit beside it. And then I'll be a bit closer to the camera and just sort of see me. It's the best I can do, I'm afraid. So right off the bat we've got something of interest there, if it works. I haven't got a PS3 though. Not anymore. What have we got here? A digital voice recorder. I'm not going to get anything out of the boxes. Not yet. And long and telephone. There's probably absolutely nothing wrong with that, although it does... No, that lead, I thought one of the leads were missing, but that's there as well. I can actually plug this in and try that. This is looking a wee bit more interesting than the other box, to be honest. Ultimate wireless charging station. It doesn't say what it's for. Four, but it looks like it's a dock for controllers, maybe? Really charging your phone, wireless earphones and smartwatch. Art phone. Senior series. Oh! Oh! <laughs> it's one of those mobile phones designed for, um, you know, the elderly and whatnot. Look at that. I already opened this one up because that was, um, well, too easy and I was curious. 
So does this charge just via a USB cable? It seems like it. You got a little dock here. Um, the battery is still. St this has never been used. The battery is still sealed. So this this has literally never been used. Awesome! We're going to have to give that a look at, aren't we? Don't get everything back in there. We've got the, all the leaflet. I can't believe everything is actually still sealed in there. I'm guessing someone bought it. Bought the wrong thing, maybe. And just sent it back. But the problem is is with these you know with companies like Amazon or any big store like that even your you know stores on the street they can't put it back on the shelf even though there is nothing wrong with it because it's been opened it then becomes a used item so they can't sell it as a new I don't know why they don't just have a section in the store you know where they could just sell stuff like this cheaper as used goods what we got we have got more Apple earpods. I got some of those last time. I gave those to my sister. <laughs> got more earpods. I got one box. I suppose I better open this one up just to see what it is. Um, just as soon as I figured out how. What have we got in the brown box? We have got. Oh, it's a monitor bracket. It looks like that's for a wall, so you can mount it straight on the wall, maybe. We've got plastic bits here as well, but that is literally it. Yeah, I don't think they go together like that. That looks like some sort of bracket for something. No idea. i tell you what. If you're one of these folks that uh, do car boots on a regular basis, you know, gambling on something like this for 50 quid, or even some of the smaller ones, um, I don't think you could go wrong. We've got some Tozo wireless earbuds here. My Madi, I think that's how that's pronounced. Enjoy your music. Uh, this one's taped up. We'll have a look at some of these in, once I've got the box emptied. So this could be a long video, because there is some of these I do want to open up. We've got... Ah, a broken set of headphones, but... Yeah, I don't think these can be fixed. Which is an utter shame because these are Sony and I absolutely love Sony products, especially headphones. My wireless headphones that, that I use on the computer, I've used those for about six years and carried them. Some more he um, earbuds. Mm. Spectron BS 10RM. They're there, they haven't been put back in the box properly, but they are there. Maybe they're faulty. Um, I did get several headphones and whatnot in the last box. Don't mind him, he's just playing with a bloody sponge. Um, I did have one pair that was broken, but I fixed it. I had an inline volume control and whatnot for it, which had just fallen apart. Um, well, I've clipped it back together, but it needs gluing, really. And then there was another set there that did actually have one side not working. What we got now? I'm literally just putting my hand in the box and just picking them out by at random. By at random? I'm so good at my grammar, aren't I? What is this? 
phone case. Ah, it's a phone case. Oh, you can put cards and things in it as well. That's actually quite a nice one. You see, something like that would be nice on a curb. I mean, I've got several, you know, cheap, crappy ones, generic ones in the last box, but something like this, I think, would actually um, possibly sell on a curb if you just displayed it like that. Speaking of generic phone cases, <laughs> there are some weird names out there, I don't even know. Lulnh, L-U-O-L-N-H is just basically the spelling. Just a generic phone case. I like the style of it though, <laughs> but I haven't got a phone that would go, go on. I've got a case on mine already. What have we got here? Some more wireless earbuds, I think. Yep, I do believe that's what this is. Whoop. Yep, some more wireless earbuds. No idea if they work, no idea if there's anything wrong with them. So, headphones in a box. There's a lot of headphones in this one. I have noticed that. Oh, the obligatory batteries. <laughs> uh, is that some sort of photo printing paper or something? Compatible ink cartridge. Zinc cartridges in it. Maybe that's what this is. Just zinc, yeah, I think cartridges for something. Yellow, magenta, blue, and black. Well, as this end is open, I'm guessing someone opened it and realised they bought the wrong ones. What's this? These are Philips. Philips. But you can't guess what they are. If you guess headphones. You guessed absolutely right. <laughs> uh, ooh. A charging dock for um, for X1 series. Does that mean Xbox One controllers? That's going to be an ask because a friend of mine recently bought an Xbox One and has actually gone and bought a charging dock. <laughs> And I've now got one right here. Now, I don't know anyone else with a um, Xbox One. Oh no, these are actually quite useful. Especially when um, TV remote controls like to die. And you can never get an actual replacement. Can you? And this is one of those one for all uh, universal remote controls. As that is actually all in the box and ready to go, I might actually keep that one for myself as a spare and get rid of my other ones. What on earth? Oh, hello. More battery. <laughs> I'm not going to be short on D cell batteries for a while, am I? Is that just a bit of. Oh, he is attached to something. Sort of little bag for something. I'm not sure what it is though. That's rubbish. Probably the biggest box in here so far, but what is it? GPC image. It's taped up. Um, ink cartridges. Big box of ink cartridges. <laughs> oh, blimmin' heck! There's more wireless earbuds! We'll have a count up when we're done and see how many I've actually got. We've got a power adapter for something. 
like someone lost their temper with that one. <laughs> right, next. Not for peace sake. Got some Sony earbuds there. We'll be doing a lot of testing with headphones, aren't I? Gigaset made in Germany. What the? Can I open this? This is a phone. Remind me, it is a phone. It's been dropped because the screen's been smashed. But does it actually still work? That is um, the question. <laughs> it's actually charged and working. <laughs> Holy crap! You know, if, if it might be a bit awkward to use it with that busted screen there because it is a bit rough. But it works. I don't know if you could get a replacement screen. I would have absolutely no idea how you do it on these. No, I don't have a SIM card. Let's power it off. If I ever see that seller putting some more of these up, I'm definitely buying another one. Because I'm enjoying this. What we got here? A digital AV adapter, lightning. So that is another Apple thing, isn't it? I believe it was, yeah, lightning port. No good to me because I don't actually have an Apple phone or anything like that. This is quite heavy. Amazon Basics. <laughs> More D cell battery. <laughs> oh, I'm snorting. Oh, hello. Oh! Got another Bluetooth speaker here. Oh, I like the batteries. I have the buttons. Is that the on button? Currently not doing anything. I don't know if that is the power button though. What have we got under there? Uh, USB. I've like got a headphone socket on there. Is that the Or is that for like an external power supply? What's an AUX socket? Yeah, I'm assuming the circle button there. We've got one in the Bluetooth shape. I don't know if you can see that. That's a nice looking little speaker. It's made by Otomi, Votomi. I'm not sure if you have to pronounce that thing on the end. those waterproof phone cases which is pretty much just like the one on my phone actually. Yeah. Let's get rid of that. That's rubbish. Tell you what that box is rubbish as well. Let's just get rid of that. It's got a bit squished there though. I might, I might be able to straighten it out. If not, bin. what's this? It's uh, uh, oh HDMI video capture. Ooh, a fair bit of weight in that. That would be handy if you um, you know did console streaming and whatnot. That might be handy for that, so you could you know, catchy your gameplay. That's fairly new, it's got USB 3 on it. it does take a power supply, the looks of it. 
box is rather beat up, but interesting item. Not done yet, guys. An adapter, parking. V Vessa adapter. Looks like that is for some sort of TV bracket, maybe a Vessa brand TV bracket. We have got power delivery fast charge plug. It's got switch, phone, tablet and laptop. One of the few items that I've had that's in a plastic package. Seriously, another set of earpods. Should message my sister and just see if the ones I gave her actually work. Well, if they don't, I've got another three pairs <laughs> to try. <laughs> I might see if my brother wants some. I think he still uses. Um, Another pair. <laughs> Another pair of wireless earphones. We got? This has got some weight in it as well. Alright, oh, it is a power brick for Apple Mac maybe? Yep. That will be handy to keep as a spare because I do actually have two um, Apple Macs, don't I? Macbooks. I still want to get working. Oh, an Apple OS! I want them actually working as intended. Are you attacking my box? Where's my drink gone? I should have a drink around here somewhere. I don't know where to put it. See the empty can? Where's that gone? On the laptop? Nope. It's disappeared. Have you stolen that smudge? Oh, it's here. Yeah. <laughs> I thought this one was the empty can. It's not. Right. You watch, I'll knock that over now. Alright, second largest box in here. I think it's just something to do with printing in. Oh, it's another indoor area. Oh, it's an indoor area this time. Oh, a smart looking one as well. I've got a couple of those crappy little flimsy, you know, paper thin ones. Can't get this one out of the box, not without help from slicing dice. <laughs> Maybe. Breaking every health and safety rule in the book by cutting towards it. There we go. Yeah, it's that style. I don't know if anybody actually ever uses these nowadays. I mean, this is now like the fourth indoor antenna I've got now. We've got the base in here as well. Just, it's an unusual antenna, isn't it? I'm not going to bother putting that back in the box because the box is pretty much ruined anyway. Some paperwork there, but I bet that's not much use, you know. How could you go wrong with this? Oh, it's a powered antenna. Oh, right. You plug one end into your power socket, the other end into your TV. Bob's your uncle. That might be why this is so thin. <laughs> oh, 
Oh! USB power connector. That is the antenna is permanently attached to that as is you put out to your TV and your power comes in literally by a USB. Just a bit of packaging. Old uh, micro USB from the looks of it. It's not a USB C or anything like that, that's a older. Alright. That's no good to me because I don't have a Sky HD box. Ooh. Oh, this one's got quite a long um, cable. And it's switched. I love the ones that switch. That's six way. Yeah. Got one of these last time as well. What's that? The fourth pack of Apple AirPods. <laughs> Gaming headset. Uh, we're nearly there. We've got some Vata C cell batteries. Brand new. Phone case. Wireless um, earbuds with one missing, unless it's rolling around in the box. Robert's radio alarm clock. Something for Apple phones, it's like an adapter for something. Splitter maybe, it doesn't say on the pack what it is. Another phone case, I know it's in a wrap, brown, brown wrapper, but yeah, there it is. We could feel the edges. Right. And the last item, <laughs> there's another pair. Phillips headphones. Well, I'm definitely not sure on headphones or wireless earbuds this time. Or wired earbuds actually, especially Apple ones. There's one more item in the box now. It's called a cat. that many D-cell batteries. Well this box has got 12 up. I've got a feeling just from the weight there's more than that in there. I don't know what I'm looking for and I can't. I can't find the lid opening so I'm just going to make one. There's 12 in here, two rows of six. These ones have been opened though. One hasn't. I've got those. 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 <laughs> so we got battery wise. Oh. And those, but the is rolling everywhere. Yeah. 
well those ain't no good because one of the earbuds are missing and these look exactly like ones I won at the arcades last year yeah it's no good with uh, only one in there few good items in there. I've got a mobile phone that actually works. Two mobile phones because I've got the Senior Series one. Uh, got the wireless charging station there. We've got the wireless charging station for the controllers. Uh, oh yeah, I've actually got a controller. Digital voice recorder, wireless earbuds, we've got so far, I guess I found one, I think I've just thrown the others over there. <laughs> I'm moving my drink, I'm just going to shuffle forward, let's have a look. Two. Oh yeah, we've got a land phone, so we've got three phones technically. Three Apple earbuds. I know there's more than that in there. Headphones. We have to find something to test these headphones with. I always thought they were the same Philips headphones, They're, these are actually different. Home entertainment headphones, that's these ones. Uh, 2000 series. And these are those headphones, wireless on-ear headphones, big bold bass. Bluetooth. Are those ones are wired, yep. I might have to get some music on my uh, phone so I can try all of these earbuds and whatnot. Oh yeah. Ah, I knew there was another set of those. There we go. That's the fourth. So, this is the uh, gaming headset. So that bit has just come out of there. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's broken. It's meant to stay in there. There is some screws in there, maybe that might be fixable. I'm going to put a question mark over there, that might be fixable. There is four screws. Uh, that ain't no good. Oh yeah, there's a charging dock for the Xbox One series. Oh yeah, I didn't want to watch looking at this, didn't I? It's like one's got enjoy your music written on it. Oh it's an MP3 player. Possibly MP4 as well with the screen. Got a mic on it as well, so you can record. Nope. No. Mm -hmm. 
the power button seems a bit... Ah, oh, see, we put a little memory card in it. Well, if I can get that working, it'll be a nice little device. Right. Wireless earbuds pack number one. Wired earphones, headphones, headphones. You've got one, two, three, four, eight, nine, ten different sets of headphones and earphones. Eleven, because we've got so many ones there. Oh yeah, that's that thing is. There's another box of that I'm missing. This box, it's a bit like that. Small. In this box, I got one. Oh, we've got that broken set as well, haven't we? I? I can't remember where I put that. So if we count that, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen pairs of. Wireless headphones, headphones, and so forth. <laughs> Fourteen. I actually really do hope the Sony ones work. Oh, these are for smartphones. So does that mean they've got uh, either a USB jack or a smaller jack on them? Start chasing me wires. <laughs> Gonna chase any wires, go and play the ones on the headphones confirmed broken. Yeah, I've got a jack on here, but I need something to get the bloody rubber door open with. That button's for is that to answer calls with? Right, I'll have to check that then. What's in this? Oh, spare rubber ear bits in case you lose them ones. Sweet. I can't test these, but I ain't got an eye for them. <laughs> uh, could I sell them? Probably. No, I could pull a cheeky one and just sell them as is, you know, here you go. I don't know what they'd be worth. They do look like they have been opened though. I'd prefer to test them, I'd prefer to find someone with a iPhone who can plug these in and test them for me. Uh, what was this? Oh yeah, that was the Apple um, power supply. I'll have to try that. I can try that. That is one thing I can try. You've got that weird ass bracket thing. I've got a power supply here, but it's all taped up. Try and open the box without slicing the leg open. That's a four. 
laptops, modern laptops. And it's got the USB connector on it. Um, I can try this. I would have to take it over to Mum's and try it on her laptop, but yeah, that I can check. And why have we got a bit of threaded bar in here? That's all that is. It's literally just a small piece of threaded bar. Ah, I can see why this was sent back. Because it is actually damaged. The earth pin is damaged. sure we can fix that. I bet this arrived that the box arrived that the customer's damaged like that because that this was actually laying in the box that way. So if that's the case, yeah, I got damaged during the transportation. I don't know why I just did a Dracula accent. Uh, have a quick look at the uh, radio clock. I don't know if Roberts still exist, or if it's a Chinese company that's uh, using the Roberts name. It is quite a nice looking clock radio though, for a modern one. I'm guessing that's where the memory backup battery would go. close enough to a socket to uh, plug it in and try it. I do like the grey coloured flex. So it, just, it matches the appliance a lot better. I, I do prefer it when manufacturers do that. It's not essential, I just prefer it. There's a headphone jack on the back as well. A nice little bag to put it in look. that I didn't reuse because I'm a pilk. Just, um, just get this PS3 controller out. It's a wired controller. It's a PS2 controller. I'm completely wrong. It's a non-Sony branded one, but yeah, it's got the uh, PlayStation 2 connector on it. It's not rattling. I wonder if someone bought this one in error, because that's not even been unravelled. Look, it's still got the um, tie around the cable. Ooh. Well, that's going to be very useful because I do not have any decent um, controls. Well, I still haven't tested those two I got with the other PlayStation 2 yet. Um, so I've got to test that as well now. Got to move the new bike out of the way. I got myself a bike yesterday. Again. I don't need any more bikes. I've got enough of the damn things now. What is this then? It's just like a little pouch. Ah! I was just wondering if it had something for like, you know, you put your belt through it or something. And it has indeed. So yeah, I'm guessing you could just put it on your side. Probably ideal if you go on a hike or something. Or just out to an event or just out in general. Not sure if that would be something I'd use. And that this wireless. Okay, it's it's all there from the looks of it. We've got the plug, the USB cable. I can't test this because I haven't got anything that charges wirelessly. Well, that's new. That's got a red USB socket on it. I'm assuming for phones and whatnot, you just lay them on there. I can't 
can't see any reason it wouldn't work. There's not really, there's only a coil in this. Unless this has stopped working, but I can always test the power supply because that is just a standard 5 volt USB supply, so. I could plug it into something else and charge it. I will double check it on the side here, though, just make sure it is 5 volt out. Yeah. So it's just a standard 5 volt USB adapter there, so I can test it on something else. So my theory would be that I haven't got anything wireless to test this with. If this works, that should work. There's <laughs> literally just a coil in there, as far as I'm aware. What oh, that is. And again, it doesn't actually look like I've got any hint that it's actually been used. Look, because the cable has still got the tie around it. And I don't know anyone who would um, return something like this and go to the effort to roll the cables back up. You might get people out there that do it, but in my experience it's very rare. <clears throat> you know, most people would just shove it back in the box as best they can. You know, everything in here like that, you know, just shove that in there and <laughs> seal it back up and send it on its way. Still can't believe that phone. And that's a senior one, you know, it's for the, the elderly and the hard of sight. Um, but it's not even been used, that battery is still sealed in its pack. So is this. There's a big button on the back, it's got a big heart on it. What's that for? Is that like an alert or something? Okay, so the back is nice and easy to pop off, he says. <laughs> I say that, then it slipped out my finger and clipped back on. Yeah, you can put dual SIM cards in here and a memory card. That feels so light without the battery. Is that battery charged? Has it still got some charge in it? I know sometimes from factory they have a little charge in, but I don't usually ship them fully charged. <sighs> you know, even that battery is light as anything. There is charge in it. According to the battery indicator on here, it's half charged. Pound. Star. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. At least it tells you what buttons you've hit as well. Go in the menu, you only get three options. <laughs> Actually, to be fair, that is not a bad little screen. It is, it's literally just a phone, just a mobile phone, that's all that is. To lock the keypad, you ain't got a code or anything to put in, you've literally just got a switch on the side. Just like the old days. Well, 
have to look through the uh, manual for this. Let's turn it off for now. I would give that to my mum, but I don't think she'd appreciate my humour. <laughs> awesome. Hmm. I was getting asked by a um, Facebook friend of mine, you know, if there would be any profit in anything like this, if you were to, like, sell everything on. It's just, it depends. You know, you ought to find someone that's in the market for some headphones. <laughs> or batteries. Uh, well, if you could test all this and it did all work, you probably could make a little bit of profit. wondering if I could use wireless earphones while I'm on the moped instead of wired ones and then put some uh, tunage on my phone Choice of two, and the first one I pick up is the left one. So let me just go in like that. Anyway. I've never worn a set of it wireless ones. I know my ears are off camera, but I actually feel quite comfortable. I'm actually going to put the left one on the left side. I believe these charge wirelessly, don't they? Um, and I mastered the art of opening the case. Oh no, they don't. There is some um, wired connections in these. That one's charging. They're charging. I think they're actually fully charged because all the blue lights came on. They've got tiny little red indicators on them. Yeah, they seem to be charging. I can't see anything wrong with them. The question is, do they actually work? <laughs> well, I'll leave them like that for a bit and I'll probably put some charge in them. There must be a USB cable for this somewhere then. It's in here. I thought this was just an extra box, you know, just to have the packaging out with, but nope. Got something. We've got more items in here than I thought. Spare earbuds. I don't think these have been used, guys. We might have. There's the USB cable. I'm not sure what this is. I think that's meant to... Yeah. That's the spare earbuds. A couple of them have fell out into the box. What's this say? Oh, it's the carrying strap thing. I did notice the case has got a little uh, thingy on it for a strap. Just stuff all this back in here. I'm not going to put the uh, buds in back in themselves. I'm going to leave them to the side for now. Bits of foam back in, let's set one in. Just 
just leave him like that. T10 upgraded. To what? Right, how about this digital voice recorder? Well, I can get into it. I taped up that side as well. I've got that one, didn't I? Is this taped up or is this glued in? What did that just throw at me? Well, it doesn't look like a voice recorder, but I've got a padlock and some earphones. And I don't know what this is. No, nope, I'm absolutely clueless. <laughs> it's just a little padlock. Okay. I need to plug the USB in, I suppose, and see if it does anything. See if these headphones are broken. Can't actually see any of these ones, can I? They are tiny ickle ones. They are damaged though. Cable looks okay. Got an inline volume control on it. Damaged. Let's have, should we have a quick look at the Philips ones, make sure they're not damaged. Fold those bits up. We can't reach them. Are you alright there, Smudge? You look like he's concentrating on something over here. They're in a plastic tray. They've not even been out. They're still um, fixed in. Yeah, they're still tied into the tray. Can't even been used. What do you reckon they got sent back because the box was damaged? I know some people would be that petty. But then again, I suppose they're entitled to if it's arrived damaged. Personally, I wouldn't. I want to know if, you know, if the product itself survived. I'm good with that. At least the Bluetooth ones. Base booster. Hands free calls. Oh, so yeah, it is Bluetooth. So that must be a charge cable then. Oh, yeah, I think it's the other ones that are. Uh, what? Oh! Phillips as well. Ooh. 
these look undamaged. They've got decently long cable on them as well. Box is totally damaged now. So just chuck some of this crap in the box out of the way. This is in a sealed bag, these ones. So I don't see any reason why these ones wouldn't work. look just like the other ones, but with a different bloody name on them. Just see if this, um, this is going to do anything. They haven't done anything after plugging them in. There's no lights or anything. No USB cable, so this could be dead. I have to try that then. I have a lot of full USB sockets. <laughs> a lot of full USB sockets. Oh, is that the cable that fell out? Did that fall out of this maybe? Those are ones. These are the last of wife the Wi-Fi, the wireless ones, so they are present. Do they work? That's the question. J eighty is user user manual. Yusha, even. A Yusha, Yusha manual. Let's just make sure these uh, Betron ones are in here. Yep. Carry case there with a few spare bits and bobs in. Give them a check as well. I think that is it. I don't think. that lightning digital AV adapter. Oh yeah. I'm just trying to refresh my memory on what that was. And a couple of phone cases. And some ink cartridges. I forgot about those. Oh yeah, we need to see if I can get this to work. Another US um, Bluetooth speaker. It seems to be dead at the minute. Lots of things to put on charge and see what works and what doesn't work. Right then guys, that is it. That is another Amazon a mystery box from eBay. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to keep an eye on that seller and as soon as he's uh, got another box I think I'll buy another one. There's uh, plenty of stuff here that I don't really need. I don't need another one of these. So if I get this working, I don't know what I'll do with it. Um, the phone, we'll look into that and uh, A spare one will never hurt. Even though it's got a damaged screen on it. No, I don't know if a screen could be fixed on that one. Right. 
thanks a lot for watching everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video and found this one interesting. There's certainly some nice bits in here, isn't there? I'm certainly not short on batteries. <laughs> I'm certainly not short on bloody headphones either. Uh, oh. oh, that's the ones that were broken. Yeah, I don't think these ones can be fixed, unfortunately. Here you see that bit's all. It looks like it's just possibly just popped out. can't get the cable in either direction to slide in so that, that, might, that might actually be fixable. I thought that actually completely snapped but it looks like this is just a socket because they turn. See? So it looks like that may have just popped out of there but I need this bloody cable out of one. I can't... Yeah, it's not letting me thread that one in. won't stay on there. So it is meant to clip. Oh, I see. Yeah, the clip bit has actually broke. Ah. I mean, you could glue it, but I, mean, I could just try gluing that one in place and see if it's usable. Oh, the Wi-Fi ones, the wireless ones. fiddle with them ones as well. Because again they're Sony so I wouldn't mind actually getting those ones to um, get them ones fixed. Right anyway as I was saying thanks a lot for watching everyone. I will leave links to uh, my other two YouTube channels as well as the Discord server in the description down below so feel free to uh, check those out if you'd like to and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!